Oh, with that big custody hearing that is planned for today. Yeah, we're going to take you to that here this morning. Maya Miliette's sister, Maricris, will be in court. She's trying to win custody of Maya's three children. Now, they have not been in communication since early on in the investigation of Maya's disappearance. ABC 10 News anchor Mary McKenzie joining us live this morning. Let's get out to Mary now. Mary, after Maya's husband Larry was arrested, her sister said she would start focusing on a promise that she made to Maya's daughter. Chris Jewelay has said that she made this promise all the way back in January to Maya's 11-year-old daughter. She says she intends to make good on that promise, and a court battle is expected to start today. That was the last time I actually was able to give her a, a hug, and I was able to talk to her uh, way back in January. And I did, you know, whisper it in her ear that, you know, we will, we will find her mommy and we will bring her home. And I will keep that promise until we, you know, we bring her home. Mary Chris has vowed to continue their searches for Maya and is now also promising to care for Maya's three children, filing the paperwork last week, asking for custody of her nieces and nephew. Court documents said the kids have been staying at the family's home with Larry's parents since Larry was arrested for murder, a charge to which he's pleaded not guilty. Mary Chris says they've tried to communicate with the kids, but Larry has refused to allow any visits. She says that he's only allowed them to have one phone call as well since January 6th. She says that Larry has repeatedly told his children and the media that Maya abandoned the family. Mary Chris adds, too, that she believes there is currently a lack of supervision for the kids. And in those court documents, references what happened during Larry's last court appearance when a judge ordered his phone privileges be restricted after he violated an order prohibiting him from contacting the kids. Prosecutors say Miliette had made 129 phone calls and about nine hours worth of those calls had been to the children. At times, they say he even asked them to read him headlines and to calculate the mortgage on the family's home. Now, this court hearing, this custody hearing is this morning at 845. Reporting live, Mary McKenzie, ABC 10 News. Thank you, Mary. We have complete coverage of this case on our website. If you want to get familiar with all the details, that's at 10news.com.